Helga from Minerva and in this video I want to share with you our top 10 patterns for pajamas and loungewear. And I've also included some fabric suggestions for you to pair with each pattern. Everything I will mention is going to be linked below so you can easily find it and purchase anything that you want to make. Our first pattern is from Closet Core and it is the Carolyn pajamas. As always Closet Core has really chic and fashionable patterns so obviously their pajamas couldn't be any different. And you have a uh, a couple of options for both the top and the bottom. So for the top we have the short sleeve and the long sleeve and you actually have two options for the long sleeve. You can have the kind of more decorative cuff or no cuff and then you have the trousers or the shorts and again you can have a decorative cuff on the bottom of the trouser or not. This pattern features an elasticated waist which I think is incredibly comfortable. Bottoms have pockets so that's a great plus as well. And for fabric, I chose one from the Minerva Core range. This is the brushed cotton fabric and I chose the color Beaufort. I really liked this one. I thought it had a nice winter feel, you know, kind of looks like you're going on holiday in a cabin. Next we have a Simplicity 8520 and this is for a onesie and it also includes some booties so that's cute it's for women and girls you have the adult size and the uh, child size and there's an option with pockets and a hood there's options without pockets and also there's an option for you to do a different colored sleeve to the rest of the body there's a little bit of variety in this one and it really means that you can mix and match quite a bit it's great to wear you know getting cozy on the sofa watching a film It'd be really cute to have matching onesies. For this one, I chose the Minerva exclusive Dancing Light Loop Back French Terry Stretch Knit Fabric. This is one of my favorite from our exclusive line because it's just so beautiful, colorful, and playful. I think this would look really sweet as a onesie. Next we have the McCall's 7518 and this is again a onesie but this one's for the whole family including your dog. So I know that some families are uh, maybe just a couple and their dog and that's definitely my case. So you have the onesie with the hood and the pockets too and then you obviously have the pattern for the doggy jumper slash onesie. <laughs> I, just, I just think it's adorable. For this one I chose the Minerva Core Range Medium Loop Back French Terry Stretch Knit Fabric and the color green. This is kind of a pine green. I think this would wear well for all of the family. Then we have Simplicity 9455 and this is another one for the whole family. So I know that not everyone finds onesies comfortable. Two separate pieces means that everyone is going to be happy. We only have the long sleeve top and a long trouser. The trousers do have pockets and the top has a um, little row of buttons so it's easy to take off and put on. For our fabric suggestion for this one, the Minerva exclusive two can play loop back French Terry stretch knit fabric. This is a black fabric with a white print, so not too bright and colorful, but it has these fun palm trees and little toucans and some other geometric prints. And I just think this is such a fun print. Then we have the McCall's AT56. This one is for a PJ set for women. It also includes a robe. So I thought that was quite nice that you have the full set. You can do the robe in two different lengths. So you have kind of a knee above the knee length and then you have a longer version. You also have a long sleeve and a short sleeve version for the top of the pajamas and a shorts and trousers version for the bottoms. I also think this would make a really nice gift for somebody. So the fabric that I chose for this one is the Minerva Core Range Cotton Voile in lilac. I just think this lilac color is really beautiful, really fashionable. It's a color that I see everywhere and it also just has a kind of chic feel to it. It would just be a really luxurious set of PJs. Next we have another Simplicity and this is the 8269. So for the adults you have a top and trouser combination and for the children you have a onesie. So the suggestion that they give you on the images for the pattern are that you make the top in one color 
and then the bottoms for the adults and the onesies for the children in the other fabric. Keeping that in mind, I chose for the tops for the adults the Minerva Core Range Medium Loop Back French Terry Stretch Knit Fabric in the color red. It's a very Christmassy, festive color. And then for the bottoms, I chose the Minerva Core Range Brush Cotton Flannel Fabric in the navy and red option. So this is just a really classic flannel. It has that kind of wintry vibe without it being too Christmassy. Then we have the Jolly 3244 footed pajamas. This is again a pattern for a onesie. You actually get the adult sizes for both footed and non-footed onesies and then you have the same for the children's sizes. So for fabric for this one I chose our Minerva exclusive Serene Meadow loop back French terry stretch knit fabric. It is a cream background with some pastel flowers, pastel little hedges and circles and things and I think this would be really cute for a family set of PJs. Our next pattern is the Simplicity 1562 and this one is just dressing gowns or robes whatever you call them. You know a men's size, a women's size, and then two children's sizes. I think dressing gowns are something that a lot of people start to get out at this time of year. It's kind of like wearing a blanket. When I had that thought I realized that the perfect fabric to make these dressing gowns would be our Minerva Core Rain super soft lush cuddle fleece fabric. This is so soft, you don't even understand how soft this is. And I just thought that this dark mint was really nice for the whole family. Our next pattern is the Simplicity 8272, and this is a whole set of different options of PJs for little girls. So you get a little top with peplum, which is adorable. So it's a no sleeve top, but it has a little frill at the shoulder. You get both shorts and trousers with that. The trousers have a nice frill at the bottom instead of a cuff which gives them a little bit more volume and a little bit more fun and you also get another option where you have two ruffles instead of just the one. You also have a long sleeve top which adds an extra ruffle over the peplum and it has puffy sleeves. You also get a dressing gown in the same style with the puffy sleeves with a little bow at the at the waist and a big ruffle at the bottom. And then you have a dressing gown which includes some pockets and a really sweet bow at the waist. I chose just one fabric for this because I think this would look really cute in this fabric and it is our Minerva Core Range 100% cotton fleece fabric in baby pink. Of course, baby pink. This is a super cozy fleece fabric. It's 100% cotton, which is really good for children's wear. It's breathable again because of the cotton, but super warm and cozy. Our final pattern of the day is another Simplicity and this is 9202. One of the reasons I really like this one is that you have a few options. So you get both shorts and trousers, a little bit more versatile because not everyone wants to wear trousers to bed. You also have two options of trouser with an elasticated cuff or a normal straight trouser. So we have a few options here, which is really nice. For fabric suggestions, for this we need a different fabric for the top and the trousers as per the instructions on the pattern. So I chose for the top our Minerva exclusive Jungle Dreamer loop back French Terry stretch knit fabric. This is I think my all-time favorite prints. They're either jaguars or cheetahs. You have lots of different kinds of leaves in different shades of green. You have some flowers in different colors as well. For the bottoms I chose our Minerva Core Range light cotton flannel fabric in the color forest. I think this green really picks up on the green of the leaves of the Jungle Dreamer uh, fabric so I think this would be a really good combination. So normally when you make pajamas you make a plain top and the trousers are the ones with um, a fun print. I don't know, I just decided to do the opposite here so that it would be a little bit different and a little bit more unusual. Those are all the patterns that I wanted to show you today and all of the fabric pairings that go with them. I will, as always, leave everything linked down below so you can easily uh, access it. You, you can easily find different colors and different options for these fabrics if you want to go similar but not the same. 
And when you're done making your PJ and loungewear sets, then you can share them on our website. If you register, you can create a free account where you can build a, port, a profile and share photos, videos, um, and posts of all of the things you make. You can link the materials that you used from our website so that other makers can easily find them. And it's just a really good place to meet other people who enjoy making the same things as you. It's a great place to pick up tips and inspiration. Meet other like-minded people. It's one of my favorite places to be. I really enjoy looking at other people's creations and it gives me a lot of motivation for my own. So that's all from me for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.